Swati is a regular girl. She follows a pattern of life most working professionals do. You know, reach office at a certain time, grab her opportunities and climb to the top of her ambitions. Swati is a girl of many dreams and vision. She loves her job and is recognized for her efforts and talents. She is, in fact, the life of her office. A fact that her blindness could not take away from her. But Swati is not the only one of her kind. Eric Wahim Mayer, who climbed Mount Everest in May 2001. Zohar Sharon, the successful golfer who proved blindness is not a deterrent. Dipendra Manocha, director at DAISY, digital accessible information system who lets others see a new world of technology. Charudatta Chadav, Head of Innovations and Strategy, CTO Enable at TCS, who is an inspiration to even those who have perfect vision. Today, 400 visually impaired persons work with established companies across India, a number that makes for a ray of light for many other ambitious visually impaired persons. The whole program started way back when we were working with visually impaired kids as part of our corporate social responsibility. And then the volunteers came up with the idea of designing a program for visually impaired graduates. The kind of encouragement that they get, they know that they can compete in the world with anybody else on equal footing. And that is the whole concept where it's not that you are doing a favor, it is just that you are providing an opportunity for them with that as the basic concept the whole program started. And since 2008, we have been conducting these programs in batches and there's a very rigorous selection process to select the people who will be trained by TCSS. In my experience, uh, these people like to be treated normally. They like to be, you know, competitive. They get through all the normal assessments or, or recruitment norms that any normal person would be put through. Today, the world has evolved, technology has evolved. There are more than enough platforms available to support these initiatives. When you talk about visually impaired, people talk about hindrances. But technology is there to take care of the hindrance. Screen reader is all that it takes. And when it comes to around uh, moving around the campus, moving around the facility, assign a buddy and it takes just one month. After that, they're completely independent. But the amount of positive attitude, the amount of creativity, the amount of resilience, and the amount of problem-solving skills that they bring to work, uh, that is what you will cherish for. There would be assistive devices, the bridging software, which people without vision use to be able to connect to the application. So that's something which we help provide from the organization side to employees so that they're able to easily connect with the software application. This is just like we provide a laptop or a desktop or, a, or even a desk or a chair to any other employee without visual impairment. So one has to be clear that to be absolutely inclusive, a software which is usable by a person without disability in X amount of time should not be taking more amount of time when used by a person with disability. So all the tuning that we do to the software applications are meant to make sure that there is no gap that exists between the time taken by a person without disability and the time taken by a person with disability while using it. That makes them truly productive. It's truly a privilege to be working in a world where disability is not considered as a buzzword, but rather is a true core value in corporations. The key thing that actually people with disability, or more to say people with visual disability bring to the table, is their ability to think a little differently. For the interviewing process, we definitely need to sensitize the hiring manager and also our leaders. Because we also get the candidates which are experienced in this space, and the sensitization of leaders is a must there. At ACTC, Advanced Computer Training Center for Visually Impaired Persons, we encourage our visually impaired students to see the light that the future holds for them. Selected students are trained in ACTC's state-of-the-art lab with the help of JAWS, a special text-to-speech software. Special courses are designed focusing on training in IT, service management, BPO and soft skills. 
Full day training sessions are conducted in batches of 15 for 45 days. This rigorous practical training has seen over 100 students completing the course in four years with 65% successfully employed in areas like infrastructure services, internal IT and service management, BPO processes, learning and development coordinator, life skills facilitator, human resources, global help desk, accessibility testing, quality assurance, software testing and maintenance, with eight different multinational companies. What we require at the workplace is soft skills and technical skills. TCS ACTC program has helped us in developing both the skills simultaneously. We feel more confident. We feel confident that we can now compete with our sighted counterpart. During this course, we also got an opportunity to meet and interact with many industry leaders that gave us an insights into how people work in the corporate world. The visually impaired make for some of the most employable candidates. They represent the single-minded focus of achieving their visions. And this determination often inspires to make all the difference to the companies they join and to the other employees. I would definitely recommend this program to all of you. It has worked for us and I'm sure it's going to do wonders for you as well. We would definitely prefer to have people with disability on our roles rather than going the other way. Why is Wipro doing it? Because it's the right thing to do. Join the journey. It's rewarding in more ways than you can think of. We have taken our first step at the bank. When will you? Encouraging talents to shine through obstacles. ACTC. Helping to make the workplace a place with a vision.